we were looking for lead um, particles and um, or lead contained in diesel fuel particles and the EM shows that beautifully but um, I used to sample in Fleet Street particularly and um, went to Bankside and sampled there and um, uh, yeah the, the, there were a lot of techniques for the light there was some um, the uh, spectral dispersion stuff there was dark field light field uh, phase contrast for optical work and um, the light field and dark field on um, the EM and uh, electron diffraction and um, we um, yes yeah, so one or two places we went to for asbestos sampling and um, we did some work uh, I think I don't know if it was with or for um, the there was a, a unit in Reading University doing research but they were funded by the asbestos um, industry and who lent heavily on them and I think they were rather constrained by what their findings could be but um, yeah I did quite a bit of asbestos and um, with the EM you can determine what sort of asbestos it was and um, it caused a bit of an upset with the asbestos companies when we found asbestos in um, bottled and canned drinks beer and stuff and um, found quite a lot of that and there were even questions in the house about this that people suddenly got very interested they would ring me up and say our wine uh, is filtered and we don't know if it's got asbestos in it I would say well send me a crate round and I'll have a look and see but um, they didn't do that <laughs> but um, the people who were filtering the beer um, they had a research lab not far from us at um, Carshalton and um, we uh, went uh, Prof Lauder and I went there and we talked to the fellow there and he said well it's filtered through an asbestos filter I'm not surprised it's got asbestos in it what would you like to drink <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Prof Lauder uh, his ears pricked up <laughs> but this fellow went on to say Lapsam Souchong or Darjeeling <laughs> and uh, that's what we had <laughs> I did have the excitement of um, sampling for asbestos on the central line <laughs> at Camden Town I think was somewhere like that I was standing right near where the um, train pulled up and the leading carriage was and as near to the brakes as I could get and um, yeah there was asbestos there but that's no surprise 